Hey guys, what's going on? This is MyHD2 and others, and today I'm here to show you the new SwiftKey Flow Beta keyboard. So, um, what this keyboard is supposed to do is it's supposed to combat swipe, and it's pretty much supposed to be like the near perfect keyboard with perfect auto correction. Uh, you know, that's what it's supposed to be, but of course, it's still in beta and it's not perfect whatsoever. But here we're going to check it out and see if it actually is better than swipe. So, let's go to the web right here and you can just go to Google type in Swift key flow and click on the first link that you see and it, it'll get you this website called swiftkey.net slash flow just go to this website and you can see this Swift key flow phone beta and then for the tablet beta you can also download that and here they have a video let's watch it That's the demonstration of it. It also has this new feature where if when you go over the space, it automatically spaces it for you. So we're gonna try that out also. And uh, okay, let's stop watching this. And just uh, okay. All right, let's just click out of that. And just to let you guys know, I'm not an experienced swipe uh, user. I'm I just started it pretty much like a week ago. So I'm not too good at it, but you know, we're gonna try out this anyways. All right, so I'm gonna try to type something. Let's type in, uh, this is a test. So I'm gonna try to do it with uh, going to the space. So I'm not gonna even take my, uh, take my palm off or my hand off the keyboard. So this, whoops, see I suck at this. <laughs> this is a, a test yeah I'm not so good at this all right let's try this again this is whoa that was horrible this um, okay this is a test there we go see that was my problem right there I'm not so good at it all right let's try it again this is a test. Sweet. Uh, let's try something else. Um, okay, let's type in my dog wets the floor. My dog wet the floor. Oh, sweet. So my dog wets the floor. Works pretty nicely. Um, now let's try it with you know, just with the, uh, the regular words, um, without like, you know, in one motion. <laughs> I don't know how to say it. Sorry, guys. Okay, um, my dog wets. That was terrible. Wets the floor. Okay, not exactly what I wanted to go for. So let's try out some websites. See if it gets to websites like Facebook and stuff like that. Oh, what is this? <laughs> I guess it doesn't work on my web browser. Yeah, look at that. It doesn't work for my uh, web browser. That's too bad. So, <laughs> Doc was through full. That is terrible. Let's try it again. Um, my dog was... Whoa, that was terrible. Okay. My dog... Music my dog wets the floor sweet okay so I think it's mostly my uh, problem because I'm not I'm not really doing it right as I said I'm not very experienced with this but it does work pretty nicely as you can see and now let's try swipe alright so now we switch over to the swipe input method and we're gonna try out the same type of tests and I'm gonna see which which one you know I kind of like better. So uh, what was it? This is a test. So let's try that out. This is a test. Test. Try that again. Whoops. This is a test. 
whoops, this is a test. All right, now my dog wets to four. My dog, that's wrong. My dog, <laughs> my dog, my dog wets the floor. Floor. My dog wets the floor. Flow. That's that's because I'm uh, swiping my hand to the W instead of the R. So my dog wets the floor. Okay, you should stop going to the flow. Floor. Okay. See. So it looks pretty much the same way. Um, I mean, I'm I'm sure that. This, uh, the other keyboard, uh, swipe keyboard, or I mean the swift key keyboard is a little better and has a, probably more words than swipe does. Um, but right now, as I'm using it, I don't really see much of a difference. So my dog wets the floor. Hmm. So even though I'm swiping my hand all the way to the W, it somehow gets floor. I don't know. I have a little bit of experience with uh, SwiftKey. I don't know why, but there you go, guys. Thank you for watching.